Good morning everyone and welcome back to yet another episode of the Ghost Fishing. Um, it's early morning again, about 5.30, just waiting on the light to come up a little bit. Today I'm fishing for Brim again, yeah I know. Brim, people don't like seeing Brim for some reason and then other people that do fully love Brim. Um, Basically, it's just an easy option today. I went out to Stones again, and we've had trawlers here for the last couple of weeks, and the amount of weed they've dug up, and we've had the nor'easters blowing again, there was nothing but weed out there. Every cast we hooked was weed, and the fishing wasn't very well. I've been keeping my eye out to see if there's any bait for mackerel. But anyway, today we're going to chase brim and I'm using it on a four pound setup. It's a little nasky and a little omen one to three kilo rod. In another video, you might see that I actually dropped this whole reel in the river, so I don't know how long it's going to last. What do you guys reckon? I left it in a bucket of water overnight. I still don't think it's gonna save it. She went all the way under. But today I'm chasing brim on something a bit different. I'm up at the mouth of this river and I'm actually gonna throw a cicada, a soft shell Temco cicada, that little fella. Something I'd usually throw for bass. Give it a run, see how that goes. Reason being I'm up at the mouth of the river, my other tip for this video is, um, I went looking up river for fish a while ago and there wasn't a lot. It, we'd had like a lot of rain, so it killed a lot of the river. And a lot of people tell me that most of the fish hang at the mouth of the rivers when We've had a lot of rain to get away from the fresh water a bit. So I'm up here chasing brim right at the mouth just to see that theory and find out if it's true. Hope you enjoy, legends. Let's get it. All right, first cast of the cicada. Um, biggest tip I can have with running four pound and just this is straight through mono FC rock um, is run a light drag basically just sit and play the fish out you don't ever want to put tension on these first cast Get in over here. It's not looking good. Feels like I'm rock fishing at the out on the stone. Size of the waves in here. Alright Brimbos, where are you hiding? So far this place is stitching me up. The other day I came here and the tide was a bit lower. And I didn't film that day and um there's brim everywhere. Typical. That's fishing for you, huh? Alright, I'm gonna move spots. This place is fishing terrible. It's 
see you in the next car. I'm going back to my other haunt. One I know that usually fishes well. See you there. Well, that theory blew me out of the water with the uh, um, fish in the mouth when there's lots of rain around. The tidal current was way too strong. I fished there a while ago with a lower tide and it was a lot better. I might have to come back and try again. Um, but basically I'm back at one of my other haunts, the one that I usually go to to try the cicada out. And anyone that's ever seen a plover, I'll show you how you can get them to swoop you. Yeah, I'm out of here. Found a little fish I come for a broom fish. Got the prawn? Yeah, got the prawn on. I just went out the mouth there then and it wasn't the tidal push was too strong. Out the mouth? Yeah. Yeah, it really is. But um I'm gonna hit here all the way up to the past the brim hole. Yeah man, I've only got four pound on today. Yeah, I've got six. Should give this a, it's a big tide, eh? What's your name? Over there, Charlie. Charlie, oh yeah, I met, nice met you last time at yeah. the shop, didn't I? Yeah, yeah I sweet. So. Yeah, I want to see the fish Yeah. Yeah. Sweet. Yeah. It's all right. Love Come. the Dewey videos. Hey? I love the Dewey videos. Yeah, yeah. I've been out there lately, man. It's been hard work, eh? Yeah, really? yeah yesterday we went out and um, the trawlers had just dug up too much weed. Yeah. And when with that nor'easter blown, it's just pushed it all to the rocks and it's just weed everywhere. Yeah, right. Absolutely everywhere. Just smell a little keen fish, eh? It's gonna come with me. Do a bit of broom fishing. Oh, geez, my phone. Foam is getting wet. <laughs> All right, might climb up here and go to the next bit, man. And then just try and flick over to that hangover branch there as far as you can. It's like a lob shot. Good fun. Even get you can get to the next one, yeah. and try and get as far over there as possible. Yep, sweet. Can't even see some little ones. Yeah. Oh, I lost him. Oh. Took the cicada, get a cast in, might have again. He had a crack at it. He was, he felt half decent actually. Yeah, yeah it was really slow slurp, but the weight on him after. Come out from under those trees. Yeah. That was the first inquiry. Four pounds getting screwed. Where'd he go? I was watching you. <laughs> I was watching you. What side is he? That way. Oh, he's gone around. Can't do much on the fourie. <laughs> Got him out, but oh, he's half decent. 
I was watching you and I heard this bush. Yeah. Like, Wait, what was that? <laughs> I light colour. Yeah, crazy colour. First one on the cicada. Yeah. The colour of him, he's like purple. Yeah. There we go. We one. want some big ones than that, but that's fish <laughs> number one. That's wicked. All right, little man. Off you go. Go on, number one. All right, that's a good sign. Maybe our luck's gonna change. Solid brim on them, but they're usually hanging down there. Yeah, no, they cast well, actually, for what they are. The old MMDs. He's made a good name for himself with them. Ballina? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, no. That's high up too. I don't know if I'm getting that one back. See if you can get a cast in right up on the inside of that, like see where that tree arch is? Uh -huh. But like, no, it has to be under it, just right up in there. Yeah. It's where I usually hook some good ones. Oh no. Oh, no. Come down at least. How when you get to a good snag when you're back in or something? And you bloody cast, first cast straight to three. Yeah, and kill it. <laughs> yeah, you kill the whole spot. I could see Brim playing up under that when yeah. I first got here. Up under that arch. The other day I came here and I casted the Hulk Prime weed, weedless weightless yeah. just, just with a hook on it and there like 20 of them come out of there, eh? Oh, yeah, on. Yes, he's on. It's a good one. Oh. Yeah, boy. He's straight in them snakes. As soon as I hit that water, <laughs> oh, we're pretty far off the water here, aren't we? Yeah. He's got <laughs> one for the day. Here he comes. High rock fishing. You can climb down here if you want. Need to try and get this lure. I thought they'd be sitting in under that. There we go. Uh, old Splashy Dunny's trick. Splashy Dunny's trick. Look at that bad boy. Under the shits, mate. You don't get shit on, but. <laughs> under the, yeah. <laughs> They're all waiting there. Sharp flip. All right, might be able to get another cast in from here. I'll right, just try. Yeah, man, get him. Right. Bye, mate. Shoo. Go on. Oh. I'm gonna try to get this out. Yeah, oh, I gotta head off, brother. Yeah, Catch up with you. Nice yeah. to meet ya. And um, if I see you around, just yeah. join in, man, or yeah. flick us a message if you're around, and we'll um, chase it. Some... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I'm always out there, man. Yeah. What? Yeah. Good luck. Yeah. I'm heading out west tomorrow, so yeah. go to chase these cod. Hopefully, I don't even know where I'm going. Just yeah. making it up. Hopefully, there's something there. Alrighty, man. Alright, I don't know if my camera's foggy, but for some reason I'm getting some fogginess on my lens. It doesn't use, usually do that, but anyway. That was a tough gig, guys. Thanks again for watching another episode of the Ghost Fishing. I turned up at my spot and the water's super murky. 
I guess that's the only reason there was bait everywhere but the brim just weren't fired up today. And we managed one on the cicada which was cool. I think on a better day we're going to nail more. Um, I was mad to meet little Charlie, he was just riding through and he spotted me. He was pretty stoked to come for a run so that was sick. I love doing that stuff with the kids. Alright guys, catch you next time. Peace.